Bend your knees, Dave. Bend your knees. Teach me. And look, thanks for all your help today. Yeah, that's fine. I'm going to get back to class. I don't believe I've spoken to this young lady. Oh, um, David Whitaker, this is Kate Ramsey. She's a student teacher. Do you mind if I have a word? Oh, I don't really think I'll be much help. I won't keep you long. <laughs> Just relax, Miss Ramsey. This isn't an interrogation. I don't really prepare you for this at uni. Has Erez Baha'i been your only placement? Well, I've been teaching for two years now and I haven't really wanted to go anywhere else. And have you had any problems with Mr Williams? Well, do you mean within school or outside? No, it's strictly regarding Mr Williams standing as principal. Oh, well, yeah, he's a good principal. In what way? He's very fair. Hmm. He always has time to listen to the teachers and the students. He's, he's not really what I expected from a principal. You know, he has open door policies, he lets the kids call teachers by their first names. He's just very relaxed. And how do the students respond to that? Well, you know, kids given the chance. They'll run riot. No, that's not exactly what I meant. They didn't seem very happy this afternoon. Well, we only had time to get some soup and a few lasagnas with such short notice. I understand Mr Williams had a falling out with the general manager of Lassiter's. Yes, but that's a personal issue. A personal issue that had a very severe impact on the running of the school today. No, you've, you've got to understand... Thanks for your time, Kate. Under... You've been very helpful. I'll take things from here. Hey, you drive. I'm too pissed to drive. Yeah, sit in the body car. Dad, I can't drive. Get me back then. Why did he get in the car? What are you having for breakfast there? Toast. That's lovely. Um, could I show you something? I guess so. He made it. It's, it's, it's awesome. It's, it's like art. <laughs> I mean, the kid's got talent. He really has. I think he's going to be a sculptor when he grows up. I mean, look at the colours. Like, and when the sun hits it from that angle, it's just like the lights coming through. It's like one of those stained glass windows. Now, look at the sun. on Underbelly.
I just want to assure the Victorian public that we are doing everything possible to solve these series of murders. There's been 21 murders, mate. Who's running this state? You or them? Russian caravan. Nice. It's all right. That's the trigger. You're on the fail safe. You caused quite a stir. Not yet, I haven't. What's that supposed to mean? You'll see. Government? Sorry? You're doing this against the government? No. The war? No. Nope. The environment? No. Oil? No. Bad parents? Technology? Reality TV? No, no, and no. What then? Reasons? Yeah, yeah, I know, but what reasons? Against reasons. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, bit, bit slow here, low IQ. Uh, you've got me sitting on the fail safe of a bomb that you say stretches for four blocks, and the reason you're doing it is no reason. Yep. Explain. What? I just told you I'm doing this against reason. And you want me to give you a reason. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Good point. It's just life. No biggie. Oh, yeah. I drug the water. Should knock you out for about four minutes. And when you wake up, You'll see. And hopefully, you'll smile. Have a good time here. In the seat, Rob. Yes, and Reg is our prank patrol rat catcher. How you doing, Reg? Hey, Scotty. This is Jess. Oh, good day, Jess. How are you? I'm good, thanks. That's good. Already to prank it up? I think so. But, Sorry. Reg, what's all this? Well, this is my rat catching gear, Jess. You see, it's all specialty gear. Looking good there, yeah. Reg. So, any requests for Reg for the prank? Well, Reg, do you reckon you could play the flute like the Pied Piper? Oh, I reckon I'll give it a go. Here we, here we are. Um... <laughs> Reg, Reg, enough. That's terrible, terrible. It's going to be fantastic for the prank, though. Sweet. Dude, you're looking a bit clean there, though. What, do you think so? Yeah, What Jess. do you think, Jess? Do you think I'm a bit clean? I think you are too clean. Maybe you should have a bit of a roll in the mud. Oh, well, you're not serious, are you? Reg, as the host of Prank Patrol, hit the mud, mate. There's only one thing left to do. Oh, what's that? Release the ninjas! I'm just gonna go and check out and see what's going on. It'll be two seconds. There's, there's not actually meant to be any trucks in this area. I'm, uh, I'm Reg. I've uh, been sent to take care of this whole area. Sorry, Reg, I don't know anything about this. The council's called a code brown. A code brown, huh? That sounds serious. It's a serious rat problem in this area. So I've been here to send here to get rid of them. Um, I've got the truck here that tips some soil into their burrows. We fill it up and then relocate the rats. Um, can, can you... Sorry, that's my good yeah, car. No, right. It's really close to my car. Yeah, no, he'll be right. He's got mirrors. Don't worry about it. OK, I, I, need to, I need to check this with the head office. Yeah, OK. Are you OK? Yeah. Just to sit tight for a second. OK. All right, well, I'll, I'll leave my stuff here. Is that all right? Would you mind it? Yeah. All yeah. right, look, I've got some sensitive sort of equipment here. I'll give that one to you, don't mind. That's the mechanism that tips the truck, all right? So make sure whatever you do... Don't, don't touch it. Don't touch it. Down. There we go. Yeah. Two minutes, two minutes. Good idea. 
with our... Rachel! 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 Oh, my God! Oh, my God! No, it just, it might function. We didn't touch it. Someone must have touched it. Sure you no, didn't we didn't touch, touch it. it. You, you sure you didn't press it? I'm sure. We didn't. Look, because it's not real funny if you did. We didn't. You sure? Yeah. yeah. Look, okay. Don't worry, I'll, I'll get someone angry. to sort it out later. Look, I'm, I really need to get these rats sorted out. So what's, right. what's your plan? You've just jumped. Well, um, I've got this rat echo locator. What it does, it picks up the... Uh, the rat signal. Rat echo locator? Um, My tech. Somewhere around here. All right, guys, you want to just, just follow me, all right? If you happen to see one, just yell and let me know, OK? What are we looking for? Are we looking for movement? Uh, possible movement, yep. You'll know when you see it. I what, really hang on, what's that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Can you just, can you just, girls, can you come over here? Just come here, oh, get down your knees. Here. Just kneel down here behind this bale. Wait, there's no, like... No, just come forward, it's all right. If I... I just want you to pull the bail out a little bit. Hey, no, no, I think it's a false alarm, guys. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a big signal. This is a big rat. I don't think I've ever picked up a signal this big before. This is a monster, absolute monster, guys. That's a big carrot. That is a... If he's taken that off in one bite, that is incredible. <gasps> See that? that that's Ew. its front teeth. That's a pretty big bite. Chickens or something. <laughs> no. Chickens? That's definitely a rat. I reckon that this shed is probably Rat Central. All right, guys. With Rat Central located, it's time the girls became honorary giant rat catchers. Rats. All you need to do is just spray it at the rat in its face, all right? It's like a rat repellent. Can I give you oh. a net, all right? If the rat comes at you, all right, you've got to go with it, everything you've got, all right? You've got to make sure you put this over its head, all right? Because it might run up your leg. Ugh, oh, creepy. Good advice. Right. Now, it's really important, guys, that we get this rat, because I'm going to lose my job if I don't, all right? All right, guys, so get ready. All right, just come forward a bit. Come forward, that's it. Nice, nice and close. I want you to be closest with the net, all right? You're the most important one, all right? If you can get the rat in the net, all right, you spray, spray him once he's in okay, the net. Okay, so... All right. That is a huge hole. That is massive, that hole. That is incredible. Surely the rat couldn't be that big. Oh, hang on, something's I got the... I heard this Can you hear that? Can you hear that? I wouldn't put your hand in there. Oh, oh I think I've got him. Oh. OK. Oh! God, he's strong. I think I've got him. I think I've got him. No, I think I've lost him. Oh, oh look what he's done to my sleeve. Oh, that is nuts. All right, guys, plan B. Uh-oh. It's yeah. never good when they say plan B. Rats love cheese. They absolutely love cheese. The foreign cheese is the one they love the best. Foreign cheese? That's it. That's nice. Let's see. Um, what have we got? Hey. All right, so uh, you can have the Thanks. cheddar. All right, you've got to hang on to that. Yep. Now, the idea is you've got to wave the cheese in circles. OK. All right, now what that does, puts a bit of scent in the air, a bit of cheese scent. Right. And the rat will smell that. Excellent cheese technique, ladies. Right. Pied Piper. <laughs> yeah, the Pied Piper. You're yeah. on the ball. OK, they respond really well. I can't believe this. she's okay. falling for this. I've studied rats for most of my life. OK, it tends to make them calm them down a little bit, makes them a bit drowsy, a bit easy to catch, all right? So keep going with the cheese. That's it. This rat better be worth the effort. Bigger movements, guys. Bigger movements. Just keep seeing it coming okay, out I can of that hear. hole. Okay, I can hear something. Keep going. Just keep seeing it coming out. Can this horse whisperer talk to rats too? Net ready. This is getting weirder and weirder. Oh my gosh. Are you feeling it? No. The tension is excruciating. Okay, I can see something in there. Scared? How big can yeah, this can rat be? It. There's definitely <gasps> movement in there. Ew. I swear yeah. I saw something. Quick, can you see it? <laughs> How you doing, Jess? Hey, Scotty. Kelsey, you've been pranked by the prank patrol. What do you reckon, Jess? I reckon it went great. Oh. Your mum was in on it too. Really? Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't very nice. <laughs>